Hey guys, got a brand new light to review today by King Bright. It's their 150 watt light with Samsung 301H LEDs, as well as separate UV and infrared channels. King Bright are a company you've done business with uh, over many years, uh, including supplying me with uh, cobs uh, way, way back in the day. They've been around for a long time and a reliable um, supplier of high quality LED grow lights to the industry. So let's take a closer look. It's a really little simple panel type light, quantum board type fixture. It's an LED um, board here, uh, aluminium plate with LEDs mounted on it. Got the Meanwell XLG driver, high quality driver fixed to the back with a little separator here to keep it uh, running cool. And then we have this dimmer control box here. It's got um, external connections, so you can daisy chain multiple units, control with an external controller. Also has an onboard dimmer, and then it has these UV and infrared switches. You can switch on those two channels uh, uh, separately and add them to um, the full spectrum light to give additional UV and uh, infrared. So on the main channel here, you got Samsung LM301H EVOs, and they're in 3000K and 5000K color temperature, so warm and a cool white, with um, added 660 nanometer reds, and lots of them. And then you've got the two additional switches for uh, UV and IR. So it took, uh, it did a test with the new Apogee Spectre Radiometer, the MS100. And as you can see here, the first one shows with just the main channel on, and you can see the full spectrum output. And then I switched the UV and IR on, and you can see those um, additional peaks of UV and IR on the, the left and right hand side of the spectrum chart. This fixture is designed for two foot by two foot or 60 centimeter by 60 centimeter grow area. I popped it into the test rig um, with silver mylar reflective walls representing um, a grow tent and dropped it down to its minimum recommended hanging height of 30 centimeters or one foot of the, um, the from the top of the te from the test area to the underside of the light fixture and I tested um, with the UV and IR off uh, just to show the efficiency of the um, those Samsung LM301H EVO LEDs and by the way Kingbright guarantee those um, LEDs they have a letter going out with each um, light to guarantee you your money back um, if proven that um, they're not uh, truly LM301Hs. In any case, I took uh, 16 power measurements with the Apogee uh, uh, ePower sensor, uh, measuring all the way from uh, 400 up to 750 nanometers, and got a average of 884 micromoles across that grow area, which is a really high level, right up there maximizing the uh, potential yield from a two foot by two foot space. Yeah, consumed exactly 150 watts, and the system efficiency is 2.12 uh, micromoles per watt or usable PPF per watt. Yeah, it's a good result for a fixture this size. The smaller fixtures tend to be a little less efficient than the larger fixtures. This one has, as I said, the Meanwell driver, Samsung LEDs, and uh, yeah, it's a pretty efficient little unit. It's on sale direct from Kingbright, and you can get it through um, Alibaba and uh, AliExpress and those type of sites. Um, I believe the price is around 115, 120 dollars um, plus shipping and all the other fees, which is um, a very good price for a light with this tech on it. And uh, yeah, I'm happy to recommend. Please let me know what you think below. Be delighted to hear your comments. I'll get back to as many as I can and uh, take care.